Hello and welcome to all of you. In this video, I, Arjun Gulia, I'm going to tell you what you should do once you register for the National Astronomy Challenge. So, in this video, I'll be mainly discussing two things. Number one, the post-registration mail and the access to the learning management system. And number two, what exactly is the learning management system and how you can use it to access your course content, your engagement session, and finally your NEC exam. So without any further delay, let's get started. So first off, what to do once you register. Now, once you register, you will receive a mail from RN in the next 48 hours. That mail would look something like this. So in this mail, as you can see, you will receive a link of a learning management system. Now, the learning management system is the platform on which you will receive your uh, preparation material as well as your exam portal as well, right? So to get logged in into this platform, we, you will also receive your username and password. Now the username will be your registered mail ID and the password, as you can see over here, is case sensitive. So remember, the password that you guys will get, you have to paste it exactly as it is, right? So you can just copy it and paste it over there. Now, apart from that, this mail lists all the process or all the steps that you will be going through in the next few months as a participation progresses, right? So let me just show you how this, your LMS or learning management system looks like. So this is the page of the learning management system. As you can see, on the top right corner, you will see a very small icon which says login. You have to click on that. Now, as soon as you click on it, it is going to ask you for your username and password. Enter the username and password you received in the mail. So I'm going to log myself in. And as you can see, as soon as I log in, I am redirected to the dashboard. So the dashboard is the main page of your learning management system. The first thing you need to do after you go to the dashboard is locate the course. Now, first thing you will see is your name will show on the top right corner once again, so that you can verify whether your name is listed correctly or not. And if you, and if it is not correct, you can always go ahead and change. All right. After doing that, to locate your course, you have to scroll down a bit. Now, once you scroll down, you will see a tab which says course overview. Now in this course overview tab, you will see that you are registered in two courses. One, the course of your grade. So whichever grade you are in, you will see a course for that grade over here. Second is the student engagement. So I'll go to both of them one by one. So let's go to your grade course first. So here, just for example, I am showing it for grade six. So here, this is the course for grade six to get into it. I will click on it. And as soon as I click on it, as you can see that now I have been redirected to the NEC grade six course page. So in this course page, you will find three things. First thing, the NEC study material. You will see that the study material will look like this and to access it, you have to click over here. And as soon as you click over here, you will be guided to the next page, which will basically show the study material in the form of a book. So it is a very interactive book and you would love reading it. So as you can see right now, this book, uh, it looks a bit small, but there is always a provision of full screen. So here, as you can see that this is how the books look like. So I will show you now to go to full screen. You have to click on this three vertical dots on the top of the book here. It says more options. I will click on it. And it, as you can see, it shows the last option as enable full screen. Now, once I go to enable full screen, you will see that now your book is on full screen and you can read it as you would any normal book. 
right? If you still can't read it, you can zoom in into it. So as you can see that you can zoom in into it a lot. And you can zoom back out. After that, as you can see that it is a very interactive book with the pages just like the real book. And we have given you a few more provisions to help with your study. First thing, you can bookmark a page. If you like to write something, you can bookmark a certain thing over here with any color of your choosing. You can even annotate if you want to write anything on a diagram or basically so that you remember or you want to, let's say, add something to it for your further revision, you can write that also. And the last thing you can do over here is if you can see on the top right corner, again, there is a plus sign. It is for you to add notes. If you want to add a particular note at any page, you can do that also. Right. So this was all about this book. Now let's just get back. So here I'm back on my course page. Second thing I will see on the course page is the NAC onboarding a student verification. Now students, this is very important. Now this is not live yet. It will be live at the end of October, wherein we would want you to share your facial recognition and one of your IDs, how to do that and everything about it. It will be shared with you through video and through our further communication. So for now, don't worry about it. The next thing that you will get is the NAC exam. Now this will be revealed in the beginning of December and you will also get a mock test to practice yourself. And then your final NAC exam will happen through this page itself. Okay. So that was all about your course page. Now, if you remember, I told you that you have been enrolled in a second course like this, which is NEC student engagement. So if you go to the course overview, once again, the second course is student engagement. And in here, we have basically added a many interactive session or challenges for you to do if you are interested in astronomy. Now, one thing I would like to make clear at this point of time is that this course does not have any effect on your final NAC result. It is just for engagement. It is just for fun. So don't take a stress that you have to do it. Right. So, but I will tell you this, that once you register or once you view in any of the courses or any of the session, you would want to participate. Yeah. So just always remember to check that out. So right now, here we have a painting competition, which is going on, which will go on in 31st of October. So this is in there. You can submit your painting on a platform called Padlet. So that is one. And apart from that, you will see that we have different other sessions listed over here, which we do from time to time. The date and the time of these sessions is always mentioned over here. And to access those, you can always access it by clicking on the link over here. And as you can see, once you click on the link, it will be guided on the YouTube. So most of the sessions we do is on YouTube live. So you will see it live, but in case you miss it, you will also be able to see it at the latest stages at any point of time. Like this is the session which we have previously done. So as you can see that this session is always visible to you. And you can always go through this session at any stage of time at the latest stage, yeah, so that you don't miss out. <clears throat> so this was all about our content and the learning management system. So that was all about it, guys, which you need to know to get started. Now there is one more thing. Obviously, you guys might have some more problems, some more queries. In case that happens, please feel free to ask us at any given time and where you can ask us, you can always ask us on our email address. Hello at the rate nationalastronomy.org. So it is written right over here as well as in the mail that we have given you that you will receive after 48 hours. So that's all for now. Thank you so much, everyone. And all the best.